All right, so first, thanks for making it out. Real big first subscriber meetup we've done out here. We got Butch here, Butch Guides out here. That's Real All American Fishing Ventures. I'm gonna let him give the brief when it comes to what to use out here today and how to fish it because he's out here all the freaking time. We got our newest member, Brandon, over here. All right, we haven't even made this announcement yet. Y'all the first ones to hear this right here. Avid snakehead angler, catches huge flatheads and blues too. Behind him, I'm gonna introduce Strong real quick. This is one of our sponsors right here, American Snakehead Custom Baits. That's the guy right here. Another lure we're gonna be using today, the curly tail frogs that you probably saw in my video yesterday. If you saw my video yesterday, I don't know if you have or not. That's what Butch makes. We got Pat over here shooting B-roll, snakehead goonie. And I guess aside from that, we can go around real quick as everybody just introduce yourself real quick. I guess we'll start right here. Great, Anastasia. All right, and who have not hit? Go ahead. Justin. Mm-hmm. Hawaii. Yep. Sydney. Phil. Nate. Adam. Michael. Josh. Rodney. All right. Again, thanks everybody for coming out. And Scott, over in the boat. He's already launched. <laughs> my buddy Jared's out here in this new canoe somewhere. You'll see him. So with that, I'm going to hand it over to Butch. Give us the lowdown, man. Throw it out as far up in these cuts. Anything you see, any log you see sticking up, throw it at it, bounce it off of it. Normally that's what causes the strike. Right now, with it being cold, we got to find out where they're sitting. When likely they're to be sitting off the line, meaning off the shoreline. Like Butch has kind of already said here, the most common mistake I see anybody make is retrieving too quickly. And then with a the cold front, that's doubly true. Because when the cold front hits, the fish kind of slow down. I mean, it's not that cold, don't get me wrong. We're still kind of in a pretty warm period here. But in relative terms, it cooled off a little bit when that rain came through. So just make sure you're not working it too fast. <laughs> I promise you that'll work better. <laughs> If you, funny. if you see a fry ball today, you got to use that I'm man. using it in a fry ball. Yep, I was going to say. You can keep it right in the strike zone and just... <laughs> <laughs> Pull that jawstring again. <laughs> I, I, I think it'll work. I think it'll work. I mean, I... Man, I can give you a hand, man. That's, that's supposed to happen. That's how it always happens. That's supposed to happen. Don't worry. <laughs> Oh man. Chong to the rescue. There you go. <laughs> oh god. Oh you. <laughs> yeah, you rascal. Put a knot in my line and everything, man. <laughs> Over here killing the game. He's already got a bass. Didn't get that one on camera. Now he's got a snakehead. I'm on the way. Is that another uh, chatterbait or what was it on? Chatterbait. All right, I'm going to start passing that word around then. All right, I'm going to get my, get my chatterbait out. You ain't got to tell me twice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, dude, there you go. I'm going to pull a nice still shot from this video. Yeah, good job, dude. Thanks, hey, that's two fish, one bass, one snakehead on chatterbait so far. Chartreuse and white. We're gold blade, or this one's a silver blade. Those are two lures that seem to that really do best here, the chatterbaits and the swim frogs. Yeah, I like, I like the gear rack you got in there, man. That's good stuff. This one or the in oh, the back? Well, that and the little rack you have here for your tools. There's two of them in there. Oh. They're kind of soft. Thanks, dude. Yeah, I'll give them a shot. Oh, if it's, I say, if it's Yamamoto, I'm expected to be soft. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Hey, what? Oh, 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 you! That's two now. Ugh. I have a nice one. And is it Elias? Yes. yes, all right. Eli, I got you, dude. Getting the grip center. There you go, dude. That's a solid fish. On that curly tail frog? Yup. That's exactly what I've missed three of my fish on, dude, right there. Real all American curly tail. Look at that. Look at that, dude. Yes. I'm glad I was right here for it, man. All right, <laughs> all right brother. 
Yeah. There you are. There you are. Nice one. Oh, son of a b I can't take it no more. That's five. That's five lost fish. Holy crap, he crushed it. Do not get off. I swear to God, do not get off. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh my god! Now that's a new American Customs buzz bait, specifically designed for snakehead. And when I tell you this thing crushed it, oh my god, he crushed it. I mean, he crushed it right at the boat. Oh, and he wanted it bad. He was hating this thing. Oh man, did she crush it. And she is off the hook. Ah! So strong. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. There's the fish, right there. Little beauty. And here is the buzz bait in my characteristic pink. <laughs> there she is. Yes. About time. About time I landed a fish, man. What a beauty. What an absolute beauty. This is how Steve fishes. In case you guys weren't knowing, he doesn't hook them with a the rod. He's just netting them. I got it. <laughs> what do you got, Steve? I got my reel back. <laughs> and you lost your paddle. Uh, yeah. You get on that. <laughs> this net catches everything, man. <laughs> Good beauty. <laughs> hmm, let it slap you in the face for the video. What did I say about that buzz bait? That one's even bigger. It's not fighting as hard, but it's bigger. Come here. Come ha. Come here. I'm not used to netting with my right hand. There you go. There you go. Welcome to the party. Now we're having a good time. Uh. Well, folks, we appear to have established a pattern. It's a buzz bait pattern. That's one of the best there is. I mean, that's just straight idiot fishing right there. All you got to do is cast and reel, cast and reel. Kind of near the shoreline, not super near it. They aren't really super tight to cover today, at least not from what I've seen. There we go. And again, that is on the American Snakehead Customs Buzzbait. So thanks again there, Tron. Yeah. And that's one more. Actually, this one is a this one's pretty thin. I think I'll let her go. The wife did request some snakehead, but this one's pretty thin, so I'll let that this, let this one go and put some weight on. That's a big ass All right, little beauty. Thank you. You are free. <laughs> Oh yeah, gotta love buzz bait fight. I'm gonna try and text or message everybody, let them know I just got two back to back on the buzz bait. Yeah. So as you can see, I did finally manage to land a few, <laughs> and I wasn't the only one. We had a great time out there. So to close then, I'll just say thanks to everybody for coming out to our first subscriber meetup. We plan on having many more in 2022, so make sure you're following the Legion of Anglers on Facebook for those announcements. Keep an eye out on the YouTube channel as well. And other than that, I guess the last few tidbits I'll give you are that the top producing lures for us today were the Chatterbait, the Real All-American Custom Baits Curly Tail Frog, and the American Snakehead Custom Dragon Buzzbait 2.0. If you have any questions about gear, let us know. And other than that, thanks so much for watching, folks. Please like, share, and subscribe, and have a good one.